There are many occasions when you might want to create a new custom equation combination that we currently don't have installed in visual analysis. Let's talk about how you do that. First thing we want to do is to go to the loading tab and choose the load case manager. Underneath the load case manager, selecting load combinations, we can take a look at those combinations which are currently being generated. But let's suppose that more is needed. How do I do that? Well, there are a couple ways. Let's first start with looking at it via the Create Factored Combination button. If I select that, the following dialog pops up, and I can give my combination a name, as well as how the combination is going to be handled. Am I not going to use it for design? And that you might choose if you only wanted analysis results. If you'd like to be used in design as an allowable levels type load case, you can do that, or you can set it as a strength level. If you'd like to use it for deflections only, you could check that. And lastly, for both allowable and deflections. So that's how you set up how design will interpret it. The actual factors used in the combinations are entered here. For example, let's suppose that for dead loads, I'd like my factor to be 1.5 and my live load to be 1.7. And let's suppose I'm also going to add into this case snow and let's make that 0.5. So when I enter these factors, then I can create as many terms in the combination as I'd like. If I select OK, we can see at the bottom of the list, then my combination is defined and it won't be used for design. So that's a way we can add one custom combination. Another thing that we can do is if we had many, and we don't want to type each in each one in a separate dialog, we could use the clipboard exchange. Let's look at how that's done. Here's a look at a, an Excel file where I've created the following lines. I have one line that has only the term custom combinations in column one. And the next line, I have what is a, what's going to appear in each column, the combination name, the design type, and I've tried to just demonstrate what you would type in in the various ones showing below it, and then pairs, factor and case, factor and case, factor and case, and so on across the screen. Now, if I'd like to get this information into visual analysis, the way I'd do it would be to select this group of cells and copy it onto the clipboard with the copy command. Now let's go back to visual analysis and import from clipboard. And if we do that, we see that these combinations that were in, or in the clipboard are now copied into our program. So the clipboard is, exchange is a quick way to create custom combinations.